out to get my hair cut. Um, I think I'm gonna do something crazy. Something fun, something different. <laughs> But I might chicken out by the time I get there, so we'll see. My sweater, Kristen got this for me for my birthday. My sister-in-law, it says breadwinners only. And she was like, you get it? Because we make money and also because we like to make bread. I get it. I don't wash my hair for like a year when I know I'm getting it done at the salon. So poor Emily, but um, let's go. Hi. <laughs> Emily's trying to convince me to do, I didn't say what I was gonna do, but the thing that I'm thinking about doing. Are you not gonna say? I don't know. <laughs> it's one of those things that you do and then you sorely regret it about 10 minutes after it's done. But, but not the version we're gonna do. Well, you give the best haircut ever, so. Wow. We'll just let it be a surprise. That's very sweet. If I do it. You will. I don't know if I will. Okay, I really like this, but I don't think that's gonna look good on me. You know Wait. when you see someone like so <laughs> beautiful and they have a specific haircut and you're like, I love that, but then you know. It probably wouldn't look like that on you. Because you don't have that face. You're actually wrong though. Okay, but what do you think about this? Are you gonna show? No. I really like that. I was gonna say, just a little bit. It's the right choice. This is really gross. <laughs> There's all my hair. Bye bye. Hey, I just got home. Are we ready for the hair reveal? Curtain bangs. <laughs> They still make me really nervous, but I've been wanting to do them for a while. I got straight across bangs a couple years ago. They don't look good on me, so this was scary because I was like, ugh, what if it's another huge mistake? But I really like them. These, I feel like, are a lot more versatile than regular straight across bangs because I can tuck, which makes me feel a lot less scared. <laughs> and also, I feel like these are going to be cute with, like, you know, hair up let's see just like cute things like that that feels like a cute little fall kind of look i didn't tell cody that i was doing bangs because i didn't i didn't think i was actually gonna go through with it honestly but emily convinced me and i'm glad she did and i think he's gonna love them um but we'll see and if he doesn't it's okay because all that matters let's be real is if Junie likes them and she will she's my girl <laughs> okay, I was bummed Cody's not home, but look what I got home to. If you've never heard of Fed Up, I am about to bless your whole life. If you don't know what it is, it's an online thrift store that I order from all the time. It's actually perfect because I can do a little try on haul while I wait for Cody to get back <laughs> to show him my hair. Thank you so much to Fed Up for partnering with me on this video, for sponsoring this video. You guys know I'm obsessed with Thread Up and I actually placed an order for all of the fall things. And guys, I got so many steals this time. I mean, I always do, but I feel like this might be the best, most epic order yet with how much money I saved and the stuff I got. So I'm really excited to see it and to show you. About to hit you with a little elevated Canadian tuxedo. <laughs> this Levi's jacket, I can't even believe I found it. It was only $33.49 on ThreadUp. Originally $148. I'm gonna be layering this over everything. Um, it has the cute Sherpa detail on the collar as well. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a navy blue color. Love these jeans, they're really fun. I love the cut, I love how they fit. I got them for over $200 off, which is just amazing. And then these boots are originally from Zara. They were $160 retail and I got them for $53.90. I love the little steel toe. I think that's really, really stinking cute. Next up, this top is so good. <laughs> it's from one of my favorite brands, Reformation. It was $44.80, originally $180. And this is cute because you can layer it. You can put maybe a turtleneck underneath it. You can put a sweater over it. I'm really excited. I love fall fashion. It's just the best. Does anyone out there agree? Um, okay, I got this skirt. It's from Babaton. I saved $80 on this skirt. It was originally $105. I got it for $23.80. And this is such a versatile piece. I'm gonna be able to wear it with, you know, a chunky sweater tucked in, um, maybe layered with a big jacket. I just feel like it's really, really clutch for this fall season. And I also found these shoes from Steve Madden. They're kind of like, you know, 
the classic black booty, but I really like them because they're super, super comfortable and they're basically brand new. They were originally $102 and I got them for $16.50. I think this is my favorite find from this order. This Sam Edelman jacket is beautiful. It's faux fur, it's so warm. It looks brand new. Like it's just, it's so, so good and I'm really excited about it. The first thing I thought when I put this on is this is like something I can hand down to Juniper in 20 years and she'll love it and it'll still be cool, most likely. Okay, two of my favorite ways to kind of transition from summer to fall is to just keep incorporating color but with sweaters. I love this turtleneck. It was $10, $10 originally, 49 from Zara. And another good way is to just keep rips in your jeans. You guys know about fake fall when it starts feeling like fall and then it gets hot again. Um, so it's nice to just have jeans with rips in them. These were only $15 and 40 cents, which is absolutely amazing. Putting this whole outfit at under $26. I also got this hat, which is pretty cute. It's fuzzy. It's from Urban Outfitters. Um, that up has all of our favorite brands, so that's a really big perk. And you can actually search by brand, which is what I typically do. I know what brands I love, so I just type in the name of the brand and put all my sizes, and it makes it so much easier to find exactly what I'm looking for. So anyway, I kind of like this hat with this outfit. I think it's cute. This was only $20.99. It was originally this much. I'll put it right here. <laughs> Okay, that's it for now. I'm so excited to be wearing all the fall things. I love ThreadUp so much. They gave me a code. You can use Lexi30 for 30% off your first order and free shipping. And if you haven't checked them out yet, you have to. I save hundreds and hundreds of dollars every year by shopping on ThreadUp, not to mention finding the most unique, cutest pieces um, that make me feel good. And it's just a great way to refresh my closet while being sustainable, I think. Cody's home now, so I gotta go show him my bangs. Sorry, I've talked about my bangs so many times. He's sitting outside. <laughs> I want him to see my hair. I don't want him to see it through the window. Did. What do you think? <laughs> it looks amazing. Wow, and you really? colored it darker? No, no, it's the same color. Oh, I didn't is? color it. Yeah. Oh my gosh, why does it look so much darker? I don't know, but what do you think? They're just long bangs. Yeah, They're I was gonna not say, like they, I, I knew something looked different, but I was like, it's, but how? Yeah, it's blended. Yeah, it's not as it's not as obvious as when you did the, the whole. Like, <laughs> I talked shot. about that and how much we both hated those bangs. I wouldn't do those again, but you like it? It's mm -hmm. just kind of like yeah, it looks amazing. It just it just flows. It, it flows. Just doesn't even look like bangs. Really. Yeah, it's just to the side. But they can, and then I can still tuck them. You know, which I makes knew me you were better. gonna do something. How did you know? Because <laughs> you're like, I want to show you and film your reaction, and I'm like, okay, she did something. <laughs> but what do you think? <laughs> looks great. You didn't color it. It just looks darker for some reason down Maybe here. Maybe just because we cut, I cut some of the ends off, which had like a little bit of lightness. You know? Wow, you look beautiful, beauty. I like it. I love it. He likes the bangs, everybody. Okay. Last thing we wanted to show you in this video is we finally finished our bedroom and I thought it would be fun to do just like a quick little tour. This is the first time we both like put time and energy into our bedroom. We usually put it into the rest of the house, but mm -hmm. we were like, no, our bedroom's important and we want it to be really cozy. So without further ado, Oh, oh, babe, you what? didn't make the bed. Me? I've never made the bed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hear me. Okay, let's try this again. There she is. <laughs> Hold on, the friggin' text came. <laughs> we gotta do that again. Okay, I'm gonna get into the details because I'm really, really happy with how it all turned out. You look gorgeous, <laughs> darling. This room has come such 
a long way. It's actually crazy what our furniture and everything used to look like before. I think I have a video. If I do, I'm gonna put it here. This cabinet is my favorite thing in our bedroom. It's so beautiful. I'm still trying to figure out exactly how to style it, but it's from Lulu in Georgia. I'm gonna go ahead and link everything in the room down below in case you guys wanna check it out. But this is just the centerpiece of our room. It's supposed to be the bed, but it's this cabinet because it's just too pretty. So yeah, um, Cody really likes it now. He was a little bit afraid in the beginning. He wasn't so sure about whether... so tall. Yeah, it's, like, it is. Is that going to hit the ceiling? Almost. <laughs> but I measured. <laughs> I don't know how this plant stays alive in here, but I think it's kind of like, you know, Narnia. Everything in there just gets better and better. So um, I have a couple cute decorations. This actually was... <gasps> My abuelitas, it's vintage. Well, probably, because yeah. she was old and it's yeah. really old. It's, it's so <laughs> it's vintage for sure. So I love seeing that in there. So if you guys have been following us for a while on this channel, you may have seen this chair in some videos, but we've had this chair since we got married. This was like the first piece of furniture that was nice that me and Lexi ever bought. This is the comfiest chair that we have ever sat in. Like. It's just, it just, it's so comfortable and it's so big. Like you can read here and you can just feel so cozy. And we have taken this chair to every single place we've lived because we just love it. It's kind of timeless and kind of classic for us. I, I love like. it so much. This material is really special. And yeah, we've had a lot of good times on this chair, you know? Oh, not like that. <laughs> you are like filthy. No, I didn't. A lot of good times. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> okay, also, what in the... Babe, you know this kind of stuff really irks me when you put it in our room. So well, why? I was gonna turn it around, but we're, we're planning out some cool stuff, you know? Cody literally brings the whiteboard up to me. Mm -hmm. in the house with all his hopes and dreams for us lined out on it. Your hopes and, and dreams too. <laughs> yeah, those too. Most of our furniture in here is from Lulu in Georgia. Like I said, this bed is from there. It's so simple, but so elegant. And I'm obsessed with it. Um, this pillow is from the citizenry. Also a brand that I love. I envisioned beautiful wall sconces when I kind of was visualizing this room. And these are so special. I got them off Etsy. I will link them down below. But look, it has a little pull chain. I can reach it from bed. And that is stunning, if I do say so myself. I fell in deep, deep love with these nightstands the first time I saw them on the Lulu and Georgia website. And I was like, I need them. The legs, something about them. They're just so beautiful. They have a modern meets vintage feel to them. I feel like they're so timeless. Really cute. I keep some Polaroids by my bed of our old home and when I was pregnant with Janie and it just feels really cozy and I don't know. I just love having them here. So I think they're here to stay. I have a couple books I love. I have my Bible. Um, Atomic Habits, which is a great book. These alabaster books are the best. They're just beautiful books of the Bible. They're stunning. If you haven't heard of them, definitely check them out. We used to have a fan up here, and I love the fan because, you know, it just keeps you cool. But Lexi's like, no, we have to have a chandelier. That's what's going to tie the whole room together. So the chandelier, long story short, from the main living room, ended up fitting perfectly in our bedroom and it just ties everything together. And it's on a dimmer, so we can flip this on, make it go super bright, or Ooh. tone it down to make it chill, you know? And you know, Lexi wanted to hardwire these to <laughs> our electric, so me and my dad, we had to run, you know, the wire down through the wall, connect it to the electrical outlet, cut a hole down there, wired it in. I would say it's worth it. It always turns um, out great in the end, but like, I feel like a lot of the projects and a lot of the things that I like to do are not easy per se, um, but that's okay. Nothing worth having in life is easy, right? Mm-hmm, especially you, honey. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love wow. <laughs> this rug is from Leloy. I, you know, I can change my mind about things sometimes, and sometimes I've put down rugs and made Cody pick them up after putting them underneath all the furniture, mm -hmm. and um, he's wanted to leave me for that, and I don't blame him. 
Well, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> but this rug, I knew I wanted to keep this rug in the house. I love Leloy rugs. They're such high quality. They're so beautiful. This room is all extremely, extremely neutral, which is how I like it. But this rug just adds a simple, subtle pop of warmth and color. And I feel like it kind of brings everything together in that way and just makes it feel complete. Last but not least, we have our Monstera plant that I'm shocked is still alive because I'm really not the best at watering. Um, Grover's bed with a heated blanket because he's spoiled. And all of our um, curtain hardware and our curtains are actually from Target. Our best friend, Stevie and Cezanne, make the best candles. Literally, this, I wish you could smell this through the camera, but they are the coziest people I know, and they've, of course, made the coziest Stevie and Cezanne brand, SNS, with the best candles, and I love them for it. That's it for today. Thank you guys so much for hanging with me all day. Um, thank you. Me? <laughs> I couldn't <laughs> find your face. I was like, oh. it's too far away. <laughs> Thanks for being you. I don't know why I'm thinking you, but anyway, don't forget to check out ThreadUp. You can get 30% off your entire first order and free shipping with the code Lexi30. I'm going to put the link down in the description as well as the links to most of my home stuff. And I made an Amazon storefront, so you guys can check that out with some of my favorite home things that I get asked about a lot. So all that will be down below and that's it. We love you guys. Happy fall. Bye. See you guys soon. Mm.